All right. Hello, everyone. This is Fernando back here live near Houston. Yesterday, I was at the Johnson Space Center. Today, I'm in Galveston. Bought, but I'm doing some more sightseeing today. And I thought I would give a treat and showcase everyone two live streams. One is the outside area of Battleship, Texas, which is this one here. And then in a little bit later, I'll be doing the actual Battleship, Texas tour, like uh, uh, inside or out of the ship. So it just depends on how much the Wi-Fi or whatever the live stream signal is there. But yeah, this is right outside the ship. This caught my eye. So if you've ever been here before, so revisit. If not, then you'll get to see what I'm seeing now for the first time as well. Apparently there was a battle, San Jacinto, that started out here. And there's like a makeshift memorial, a grave sites. Apparently there was a big camp out here too that used to exist. I don't know if it was a fort or if it was something else. But yeah, thought I would visit this place to show it to y'all. How's everyone doing too, by the way? I would gladly announce ahead of time when I'm doing the live streams. The problem is I don't know when I'm doing them. Like uh, if something is going to happen right there on the spot or if it's planned. So at least tonight, be on the lookout for some live streams from the place that I'm going to be doing with later on probably around eight ish nine o'clock central time so here we have for example I don't know is that a display doesn't look like a gray site but these definitely are by the way it is hot out here probably a hundred just by the sun and then the humidity factor is adding a lot more I believe in the far background there, that giant monument, I believe that is the actual San Jacinto place. So, this is a gravesite though. All of these are from the late 1800s, it looks like. In fact, you can see there, wow, 1873, 1835 at least born nuts when you realize some of these people are damn near 200 years old in terms of their birth like this lady Emma de Zabala born in 1870 so almost 150 years and now she's resting here for everyone to see afterward but I wanted to show you guys also this we definitely don't have this in Austin. This is by a huge body of water. Don't know the lake or what the water is called, but I've seen several large ships pass by now, and that is so cool. It's one thing to see them in movies. It's another thing to see them in real life. This area passing it by is just filled with oil refineries. You see how in the background all those giant containers, those roundish containers with the round top, that's what that is. Just acres and acres passing it by. It's amazing how much oil is here, which is the life, pretty much the blood of, of America, what makes everything dry. There it is. See, you guys are catching it. You guys see that large boat there? It's neat to watch it pass by. So that's the third one I've seen. Two more since I started the live stream. Or before at least starting the live stream. So let me just hold it here. You get to see it pass by. Cool. The other ones were a little bit larger. Nothing like a oil tanker. Like the one you see there in the far off distance. That is huge, that oil tanker. Whew. 
imagine seeing this from if that looks that big this far away imagine how this looks when you're up close let's see what's over here oh there's people fishing So you see that giant oil refinery right there, then you see the oil tanker, and you see that thing whizzing by. It's awesome. See some more oil tankers back there. Pretty cool. Now the other area I wanted to show you real quickly. It looks like I saw some more stuff up in the front. How's everybody doing today by the way? Looks like no one's really on right now. Which is again my bad when it comes to these things I can't really announce until I'm actually here and I don't know when I'm gonna be here sometimes or most of the time what does it say USS San Jacinto okay So if you go over here, I saw a huge propeller. It shows basically how large these things are. Oh, so this is the actual historic site. I thought it was, uh, the reason I mention that now is because there wasn't anything up front like pointing towards it as it being the correct, the, the actual site. But I was right. There's the giant monument. There looks like there's a reflection pool and some other stuff. There's a trail you can walk. It's cool. Not in this heat though. It is hot out here. I'm going to try to stay in the shade as much as I can. Almost there, guys. Ah, some people coming on. Hello, hello. Hi. Quick recap I'm over here at San Jacinto, uh, the San Jacinto campsite or battleground. And then I'm also over here by Battleship Texas. And here you'll get to see it from afar in all of its glory.
There it is, guys. Isn't she pretty? Massive. Not quite as big, I think, as the USS Lexington. But she is pretty. I'm going to be going inside there in a minute. But real quick, I wanted to show this. We have here a giant propeller. Huge. This is what they look like. And this is one of the smaller ones. I don't think there's a larger one. I mean a smaller one elsewhere. Look. Damn. Maybe I missed this ways. It's gotta weigh a bunch. And this is probably two of them down there. And then there's the battleground. But yeah, guys, just wanted to show that for everyone. I'm going to go ahead and cut it here, go inside the ship, see if I could do something later on for y'all. All right, everyone. See y'all soon.